Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're turning a simple splice vocal like this I would dream about the end of the world into a full deep house track like this. Don't forget to leave a like on this video as it really, really helps me out. Subscribe if you're new and let's get right into it. So we're inside FL Studio. So starting off with the vocal, I found this on Splice. I would dream about the end of the world. I would see the heavens be catching fire. I don't know if it's gonna be good or not, but it sounds okay. So let's just use it. I'm gonna start off by linking it to a channel in the mixer. And the first thing I'll add is a fruity multiband compressor. And I would, uh, Let's open up an EQ, cut away some of that boomy low end. After that, we're gonna add a plate reverb. We're gonna open up Valhalla Vintage Verb. I will see the heavens be catching fire. Just to put the vocal in a space. After that, I'm gonna open up another vintage verb, drag down the bass multiplier, up the low cut, take the mix to around 40-50%, quite a long DK. I would dream about the end of the world. After that, we're gonna add a fruity peak controller. Let's link this dry wet knob, peak plus LFO, mapping formula, inverted, accept. I will sit here and I watch, uh, I... Something like that. I'm gonna add a little bit of delay as well. Here and I watch, uh, I... So now that we got our vocal down, let's bring in some ambience. I will sit here and I watch, uh, I... So this one sounds very nice. Haven't done anything to it yet, just pitched it to the right key. Let's drag in a few steel drones as well. I would dream about the end of the world. I would see the heavens be catching fire. After that, I'm gonna link all of them to one channel. Start off with an EQ, make sure there's no low end. Then we can put a fruity free filter on there, create an automation clip. Let's also put some Valhalla Vintage Verb on there. Uh, now the fun part, adding instruments. Let's open up Vital. I'm going to be using a bass preset that's from my new Vital bank. It's going to be out in two weeks. And like all the other sound banks, it's going to have 100 presets. Top quality, super versatile to use. The low rumble. It's a real classic in this style of music, like slap house, deep house, stuff like that. So now let's find a baseline for this. I'm gonna start off on D and see where that goes. All right, I'm happy about this chord progression. I would dream about the end of the world. I would see the heavens be catching fire. I feel the end is near. I will sit here and I would. Now I'm thinking this part is going to be the build up. It's gonna be a very, very quick break and build up into the drop. And what I wanna do here right before the drop is open this bass up on this F sharp note here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up Edison and I'm gonna record it. That way I have it like this. I can reverse this and it's gonna be like this. I'm gonna copy the bass line of this. I'm gonna open up another instance of Vital and I'm gonna use another sound from the new Vital sound bank. This is the preset called Peace of Your Heart, the sound you've heard in every EDM playlist on Spotify. <laughs> Once I add that, it's gonna sound like this. I would dream about the end of the world. I would see the heavens be catching fire. Just gonna add it here, not do anything to it. I'm just gonna add a fruity free filter, fade it in with the other bass. Now let's add some chords. For this, I'm gonna create a brand new preset that will be in the new Vital Bank. That way you can see how I make my sounds and how I think when I make them. Just gonna paste in the bass line here. We'll start off here on envelope one, slow the attack, drag down the sustain a bit, up the release. Then we can up the voices. I want them to be quite detuned. We can stick with the saw wave for now, but let's add a second oscillator as well. Let's pick something like this. Let's link both of them to filter one, enable filter one, drag the envelope one to filter one, and it's gonna sound like this. If we mute the second oscillator for a little while and enable the sync here on the saw wave, we can turn it a little bit more into something in between a square wave and a saw wave. I'm gonna enable the sample oscillator as well, and I want the Bart noise. 
Now going into effects, first I'm gonna add some reverb, do some low cut. I'm also gonna add a little bit of soft clip distortion. We can just duplicate the vocal like this, drag it from here, put it over here as well. I think that's actually fine in this case, it's not super repetitive. So now we just keep adding some more elements to this. All right, now we have a little bit more stuff happening in here. Let's go ahead and add a build-up snare. Maybe this one. I will also link it to a channel and add a low-pass filter. Let's take some upsweeps and maybe some endless smile as well. All right, we have the build-up elements there. I'm just gonna add one final thing, a simple little lead. So I'm gonna use Lead Diablo from the current Vital Sound Bank. I'm gonna create a little automation clip here. I'm gonna do this. And I'm also gonna add some reverb. And at first I'm gonna take out a lot of the dry signal. And for the drop here, we're gonna do something really cool with this lead. We're gonna keep it real simple. We're gonna copy the channel pitch. Uh, so we have the first note going up like this. So for the bass in the drop, I'm just gonna copy this. We're gonna use the same sound, but we're gonna route it to a different channel. We're gonna beef it up a little bit. Gonna add some DST. Now we have our bass and our lead in place. Let's route it to a sidechain. I'm gonna create a sidechain using Fruity Balance. So we'll just create an automation clip for the volume. And let's find a nice kick for this. Nice and soft like this. Now I want the first part of the drop to be really minimal and just chill in a way. So we're gonna have super few elements here. We just have the kick, first bass, second bass, and the lead, that's it. And in the second part of the drop, we're gonna add claps, hi-hats, all that good stuff. Now I'm just gonna drag over some elements that I had in the break, like some loops, some ambient, stuff like that. Take it over to the second part of the drop, and then we're done. Let's check out the final result. I would dream about the end of the world I would see the heavens be catching fire I feel the end is near I will sit here and I watch uh,
there we go that's the final result i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you enjoyed this little drop how to make future deep house something like that i don't really know what this is it has like a don diablo lead but it's like more deep house uh, but it also has like a slap house rhythm to it. I don't know. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for the Vital Bank Volume 2. It'll be out in two weeks. But I'll be back next Friday with a brand new video. Take care and have a great weekend. And I'll see you next Friday. Bye bye.